Skippies. A good Skippy and a bad Skippy. Would you like to go out with either of us on Friday night? No. No. McNuggets? <laughs> Thanks. I know it's the door. Who is that? Hi, Connor. <coughs> Holy crap. Courtney Cox, hi. I'm a really big fan of yours. Oh, uh, thank you. You wrote a song called Courtney Cox. Is that actually about me? It is, yes. So, um... <laughs> That you propose to me, marry me, marry me, Mallory. alchemist he's cast a spell on Lord Kester. You want Vorian, right? That's right. Then join us. We'll get him for you while we rid ourselves of those creatures. Then you can go home. Where's this heaven? <laughs> hey. <laughs> Fred Rosemary's. I thought I'd surprise her because you know it's her birthday. Yeah, I know it's her birthday. She's my dead mom. What I don't know still is what's with the rubbers. Are you banging my mom?
young um, uh, young woman who's a, a PR woman, and she comes back to her hometown for Christmas and winds up working with a winery, a local winery, to help it get off the ground because they're dealing with uh, running into some time. tax you have to pay oh that's not fair can i take a do-over oh sure go ahead whoa whoa hold the phone no do-overs page four of the rule book says what a lot of girls go through on national television. And I always reached out to the average girl because I wasn't the stick figure, pretty pin up. I never had a centerfold in Teen Beat. And as Tina stepped away from the TV set and into the role of... to think I was from another planet. <laughs> Don't give up that thought. <laughs> one day my space mom will come down and find me and take me... How did you handle it? Um, I just handled it uh, like one would handle a canoe going down a roaring rapids. You just try mm -hmm. to stay. You're not Trisha Armstrong, are you? No, I'm Ellen Reed. Sorry to disappoint you. Trisha's my roommate. Well, she's your roommate. Fabulous. <laughs> Hi. Hi. I was vegetarian from the age of 15, straight through my first pregnancy. And then I became pregnant with twins. And, and I've always loved vegetables. I, I was always the person who could sit down, make a tray of roasted vegetables and just... personal question. Go ahead. Are you seeing anybody right now? I mean, do you have a boyfriend? No one special. Oh, so in other words, you are not dating anyone on a regular basis? No. Everyone knows I have Parkinson's. I've had it for 20 something, 30 years. I don't know, I could suck out. More than half your life. More than half my life. But I, I, had, I was diagnosed at 29 and I'm now 59. And I reached kind of a piece with it, kind of a detente, like it takes up the space. It's